congratulations, coach, with the, the victory. It's 2-1 now. But a completely different game if you watch the, uh, the points, the number of points. Yes, this was the most offensive game till now in a whole season. So we played eight times. This is now game number nine against them. And uh, always the uh, score was between around 60, 70 points max. Now we we played on the 90 points, both, both teams. So, but, but also we have to be honest and say that both teams scored some shots they didn't score earlier. And what about defense on Ty Wesley? He played a lot better than the, the last couple of games. He had a lot of points, especially in the first half. We, we didn't succeed to stop him, especially in the first half. And in the first half, he had a 100% sh uh, shot and he scored already 16 points. And that was our big problem. I think that in the second half, we did much better with him. And uh, that, that's one of the reasons why we build up our advantage in, a, in the third quarter and why we won a game. I think that that's something we have to do much better in, a, in, a, in the next games. Did you change things because the focus is on Wesley and also the shooters like Farag Manesh and Akmo? No, we didn't change nothing. Just I think that today we have been just a little bit late in certain situations. But also we have to say that uh, Ty Wesley scored uh, also from some other situations he didn't score earlier. So, of course, that we will analyze the game and try to prepare ourselves better for next game. You don't want to mention particular players normally, but Kashmir, right, he was great today. Yes, Kashmir was great. He was really, uh, he made a big time shots. Uh, and he was uh, really hot. And he was a guy in the third quarter who built that advantage. And uh, so, I mean, I don't like to mention because it's always, this is a team effort. But he was a guy who was, let's say, uh, playing, uh, scoring more than the rest of the team. But I'm not satisfied with his scoring only. I think that this is a game after now two months where he made uh, the less uh, defensive mistakes. So we have to say I'm not. I know that he can score, but uh, we we need him not only on a scoring. We need him also on a playing defense. And now what? One or two days off before you start preparation for game four. We have a tomorrow day off, and then Monday we will start again uh, working. We had a very tough period. We had, a, in 17 days, eight games. So really compliments to the guys because we played against really two, let's say, top teams, uh, Leiden and uh, then, then Bosch. So we didn't have no any space to any calculation. Uh, we, all of these eight games, we were obliged to play 40 minutes from the beginning till the end. And uh, we made it. Now we have to, to, to make a profit out of uh, to, take, to have some advantage out of these uh, two, three days we will have before next game, uh, to first of all to have a good rest, to have a good preparation, that physically we have we we can respond in a, in the next games. See each other on Thursday. See you. Well, 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 Mr. Kashmir, right, 31 points. How do you feel? Oh, uh, pretty good. I mean, we came in here and got the W. That was the biggest thing. The points really don't matter, but I had to do what I had to do. Just to get the win. We, we all work so hard like the team. We had a meeting. We all work so hard to win a championship, and we shouldn't let nothing come in front of that. Uh, it was a complete different game because the, the, the score was a lot more higher than the other games. Um, I guess you got to bo both teams know each other so well. So they know how we play defense. So they know how to, I guess they know how to get their shots off. And they making shots. Like They making tough shots I'm out here. Akabon is making contested threes. So it's just... A uh, matter of right now, everybody just got to keep grinding and keep playing hard. You felt very comfortable, especially in the third and fourth quarter, that you almost every shot you took, you had the confidence that it would go in. Uh, that, that goes back to my teammates and coach. They just told me to believe and go back the way I was at the beginning of the year and be confident and knowing that everything will be all right. <laughs> everything will be all right. Yep. Don't worry. <laughs> About a thing. <laughs> okay, exactly. with a little intermezzo, of course, of course, everything will be all right. How's your hand doing? Um, what happened? Um, got hit in the wrist, a little uh, light sprain, but it'll be okay. Edwin did a good job uh, backstage, huh? Edwin did a good job backstage and yesterday. <laughs> yeah, he's doing wonders right now. Um, what about next couple of days? Will you rest or still keep on practices? What's going to happen? Mm -hmm. 
personally, I feel wonderful. I feel better than I have felt in a while. So my thing right now was just, just keep icing my legs and stay in the rhythm on the court. Just keep getting shots up. And tomorrow, enjoy the weather because it's going to be very sunny. It's getting nice now, see? It's, it's sad that Summer it's, started. See, it's sad it's getting nice once we only got a couple weeks left here. <laughs> it's been raining all, all month. But, now the big time is coming, huh? Right. But that's good, around the right time, around, around the end of the finals so we, we can enjoy the weather and get ready to play. See you on Thursday. Thank you.